I I'm just listening to little Yachty. You own a yacht? You know what? Yeah. Which one is it? The big one? Yeah, the biggest one out there. That's mine. I, I think we should hang out later. I quite agree. Girl, me too. Tell me, who runs up that flag? Your wife? <laughs> uh, no, no. I do all of it. Who mixes the cocktails? Your wife? No. I mean, you just want me to be married, don't you? Oh, I'm not interested at all. Oh, well, I'm interested in you. That's very interesting. Well, I know it is. Uh, sit down, talk to me. So, um... Aren't you funny? That's what I hear. Don't you know that a man being rich is like a girl being pretty? Mm, I don't know about that. You might not marry a girl just because she's pretty. Right. But my goodness, doesn't it help? You're a smart girl, Miss Moon. And if you had a daughter, wouldn't you rather she didn't marry a poor man? <sighs> Absolutely. I think, I think we're on the same You'd page. want her to have the most wonderful things in the world and to be very happy. I hear you and I see you. Well, why is it wrong for me to want those things? You're beating a dead horse. I get it. Right, okay, let's role play and you be the blonde plumber. A blonde plumber? Yeah, she wasn't even trying to do it. I'm like, girl. What's the matter with her? Doesn't she love you? And that's why I'm saying she don't love me. I always mad when I'm with other women. Isn't she jealous? You know what? I don't know. I told her I'm cheating. She just doesn't accept me for me. That's bad. It really is. You ready for your appointment, little plumber girl? What happened? I don't, I don't really want to talk about it. You know, I'm kind of messed up about it. Oh, you couldn't possibly. Babe. <laughs> All right, this morning, this morning I lost my job. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, so. Talk about sad. I know, so I'm trying to keep my head up about it. You poor, poor boy. Why you say that? What is it? Oh, that's uh, that's my great granddaddy's fish. He was a racist. Or at least that's what I've been hearing. A herring? Yeah, that's what I. Oh, here. You know, I think that's the name of the fish, herring. Isn't it amazing how they get those big fish into those little glass jars? Uh, um... You want some wine? Baby, I'm gonna miss you so much. Me too. I don't know what I'll do in Europe without you. You'll figure it out. I, um... I don't know what I'm gonna do here. In this peaceful, peaceful home. I'm not so sure about that. Oh, I'm sure. And I'll be waiting for you at the door when you come back. You can be a pretty naughty boy sometimes. And you a pretty naughty girl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's on your flight? But there are certain men who would try to take advantage of a situation like this. Girl, for real? You know, I have been hearing about people taking advantage of people, especially in the news. One bad boy. Of course, I'm sure you're a gentleman. Oh, absolutely. Now, I would never take advantage of your little thing down there. What thing? I, I could have said that better. I, I, I don't want to try you like that. Have you tried? Ooh. Girl, you scared the shit out of me. I want to thank you for covering up for me. You're a real pal. You know, I'm always going to look out for you. If it wasn't for you, they would have kicked me off the train. I'd be out in the middle of nowhere. Uh, you know, I couldn't let nothing happen to you. We, we friends for now. If there's ever anything I can do for you, I'm thinking about a couple things right now. All right, all right. What I said yesterday was... A lie. Well, it wasn't exactly... It wasn't exactly what? I mean, it wasn't really the... It wasn't really what? Are you going to tell me the truth? No, sir. You would lie to me? No, sir. Are you lying right now? What are you talking about? <laughs> you are the most beautiful woman I have ever seen. The first man ever said that. You know, that's crazy because while you were asleep, I went through your phone. Yeah. And uh, uh, James told you that this morning? Actually.
actually he told you every morning. Damn. I mean, you fine though. Thanks. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you can get out. Did you ever think of getting married again? <laughs> uh, huh? You know, it'll be a while before something like that happens again, you know? What happened? A lot. But it's cool, um, you know, it, that's life. Everything changes, man. Everything keeps changing. Hey, at least I can get used to being friends with you. That's what I can't get used to. Why? I mean, I, I would never date you. You know, I never had an idea like that. You never had any idea, huh? Uh, no. No, hell no. No, you're not my type. I told you that. There are, uh, hey, Siri, uh, remind me to clean the house before Stain Stain come over. Okay. I added clean the house before Stain come over to the list. Stink Stink. What you say? Did you ever think of getting married again? <laughs> uh, huh? You know, it'll be a while before something like that happens again. You know? What happened? A lot. But it's cool. Um, you know, it, that's life. Everything changes, man. Everything keeps changing. Hey, at least I can get used to being friends with you. That's what I can't get used to. Why? I mean, I, I would never date you. You know, I never had an idea like that. You never had any idea, huh? Uh, no. No, hell no. No, you're not my type. I told you that. There are, uh, hey, Siri, uh, remind me to clean the house before Stink Stink come over. Okay. I added clean the house before Stain come over to the list. Stink Stink. I have this thing about saxophone players. Really? All they have to do is play eight bars or come to me, my melancholy baby. Uh-huh. And my spine turns to custard. I get goose pimply all over. Oh. Uh. And I come to him. Oh. Um. You know, I was thinking about being a sax player myself. I don't know what it is. Uh -huh. The next thing you know, they're borrowing money from you. They're spending it on other dames and betting on horses. Oh, my God. You deserve so much better. You see what I mean? Not very bright. Not bright at all. Mm. I can tell you one thing. It's not going to happen to me again, ever. Ever. I'm tired of getting the fussy end of the lollipop. Girl, you better let them know. Well, there's a little problem with the uh, the tacos that you cooked earlier. Thought you liked it. I did, I did. But it ran through you. And you didn't flush. Ugh. And on top of that, you went to sleep like nothing happened? You should go. Now. <laughs>